I like a lot of food and I like eggs. You wanna try everything? Hello guys! Time for some crazy Thai street food. We are in Chinatown now and they have so many unusual crazy stuff to eat and we are so hungry now it's a hot day in Bangkok and I wanna find something I haven't tried yet because I've tried a bunch of pad thais different types of soups uh, manga sticky rice and today we are looking for something special and something crazy I already shoot a video about the most expensive the most fancy Thai restaurant food and today is so different uh, we wanna go crazy and in a place like this it won't be hard, it won't be difficult they have Chinese food, also Thai food, also something uh, just something, lots of different sweets lots of different shops yesterday we bought here some nice flip-flops very cheap uh, like less than five dollars and it's crazy good price for nice flip-flops <laughs> Now let's find something to eat. Look at these fruit, seriously. Yeah, and funny thing, cherries is so expensive in this part of the world. Meanwhile, in Ukraine, in the Eastern Europe it's so cheap and seasonal but here you can buy some I don't know mangustin uh, some uh, crazy pineapples mangoes here there are the uh, gangster cherries for 300 yeah. baht less yeah. uh, than mandarin apples apples are crazy crazy expensive yeah it's a little bit like the fruit market here yeah. A lot of imports also. I once walked in here is everything like a lot is exported. I can be the friendly voice in the back. <laughs> My friendly bodyguard yeah. in every video. Look at the dried squid. Wow. I really like all types of fish, even dried fish with some beer, some nuts. I'm from Ukraine, you know. Some beer? <laughs> when did you ever drink beer? Never. Like it's a cultural, cultural thing. Some dried fish, some kilka yeah. <laughs> in tomato oh, yeah, that sauce. Rice looks good here. Stewed pork legs with rice is probably one of the best things in Thailand. Yeah. Should we have some? I I don't know how they do it, but all pork and all chicken they make so stew and so tender and I really like this eggs it's uh, some some crazy thing I don't know they boil it also stewed yeah, yeah they stew it in um, spices in some herbals and they are they are brown as you can see and they are so delicious very weird taste but for my taste it's it's great yeah oh it's cooking the eggs are cooking this is how they basically make them all. Very nice. Our two eggs. Oh. Beautiful. The rice looks pretty soft. Which I think is good for the stewed pork. Oh my god, this sauce. I wanna bathe in there. There we go. Rice and 
let's try. We are sitting literally in a shop, <laughs> a shoe shop, and eating. I'll try the egg first. It's my favorite. Sometimes it's a bit more mm, stew, a bit more soft and tender. This one is like hard boiled, but still good. Very interesting taste, very interesting flavor. And pork leg mm, mm, with some, some wedges. very good very good very tender hot spicy but not too spicy for my taste it's very good for the price it's only 80 baht 80 baht 80 well, baht the for 100. 100 but it's nice lunch you can be full for like four or five hours after this meal and yeah I think it's a good price good value busy day Some weird parts of the animals. Eat them all. Some local sweets. And yeah, it's pretty cheap. Really like for. 20 for 15 baht you can get a piece of cake some shops oh wow it's my guilty pleasure it's uh, food boxes lunch boxes I really really like lunch boxes and I want to have one one day for sure cool <laughs> Yeah, never been in these side streets here in Chinatown. Proper market, got food everywhere. This is the real stuff that's going on here. Look at that. Crazy crispy. Crazy crispy fish. Look at that. Is that a Tamagotchi? No, it's a popular watch. Like so, what I've already noticed is that on a main street you can mostly find some tourist stuff and the prices is much higher. Meanwhile, when you cross the street and go to the, some side street, uh, you barely can find English menu and the prices is much better and the food is much more local and much more Thai I would say but here it's so vibey uh, everything is so red as it should be it's a Chinatown so no wonder why A lot of different seafood and it's quite even expensive here.